it's results day. School opens at 9 o'clock and it's nearly 5 to 8. I'm obviously getting up at 9 because I want to be that early. So I need to get up and get changed. I'll film me when I'm about to leave. Before I get to do so, I want to show you like some presents, well not presents, they're just like little gifts that I got my free friends to Hannah, Eden and Natalia. But yeah, I just got them the favourite chocolate, I got them a card and then I went on holiday, I got them a bracelet while I was away. So I'm just going to show you like little something that I got. So they all have one each, Um, this is Eden's and like she loves Hershey's chocolates so I got her like the drops of them. And then they all have the same bracelet which is just this little like shell one. I got Hannah a card as well obviously with the bracelet. Her the shrimps and bananas. I think she likes the shrimps but I know she likes the bananas. Um and the same goes for Tal, the card, the bracelet and her favourite chocolate is Snickers. So I've just wrapped two of the double ones together. Yeah. Natalia actually got me a card as well because we seen her the other day. So I don't know if to open that on camera or not. I will, and then if I decide to put it on, I will. So I'm just going to open it now. It's ten past eight, and I've got to be there at nine. She had given me a bar of chocolate as well, but I ate it, so it's a good luck card. Thanks, Tal. It says, Dear Lola, results today is now close, and I think we are all peeing our pants. True. But I wanted to wish you all luck in the with the results today, the new school, and the future in general, no matter where we end up. I'll or what results we get, I'm forever proud of you, I'm proud to call you my bestie. Remember what it's meant to be will be, and, lo and last of all, thank you for everything. P.S. Thank you for being the best friend for the past six, 12 years, now for the next stage of our lives. Cheers. Love you forever and always. From Tal. Aww. Aww. Thanks Tal if you're watching this, which you probably will because you're a good friend. I'm going to get ready now, and by the time you see me, I should be on the way to school. Oh, I'll see you then. All right, to go. I'm starting to panic right now. I'm going downstairs to put my shoes on. It's now 20 to 8. So, yeah. There's like all numbers. I got B in PA, B in drama. Well done. English language, you got C. That's good. RA, I got B. Um, travel and tourism distinction two. That's like in a Welsh bar who got past two, which is C. I got D in Welsh. Yeah. Very well though. Uh, that, these are all Welsh. Science. Double practical assessment, a C. Biology, C. Another biology, C. Chemistry, I got a D, I don't really care about that. Physics, got an E. Um, tourism customer, does that mean merit? M2, that merit too. So, what do you get in English? I don't know. Oh. I don't really get it, as long as I pass maths. Where's. So, I passed travel and tourism, I've passed my maths. You don't have to do anything extra. No. I got it on my as well. <laughs> oh. oh, they're not yours, they're <laughs> My science, to be honest, I never really cared about because I don't need them. Look at them. that, oh, that's well, God, you made up. I only care about maths. Uh, maths. Because imagine I can see that again. I know, yeah. Uh, I should say what the others got. I don't know if I should actually. I shouldn't really give much, uh, like, like, information out. All my friends passed maths, didn't they? Yeah. I didn't get the scores though because, yeah, but this is it. You, you address yeah. that or you remember. <laughs> Yeah, so. 
Okay. <laughs> I'm fine. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna read it as well. Uh, you don't have to, but read what's inside. Too, but. Oh, uh, it says too long. I'll do my personal GCSEs. Open me. <laughs> oh. You've got to open the, yeah, that one first. Oh. Okay. <laughs> uh -huh. I'd like fold them open like this. Yeah. I'm just going to show the camera so it's memory. Okay. It's really not anything big, but... Okay. Well done, passing all of your GCSEs. Just because you did so amazing, I have a little surprise. Guess what? Guess. Well done. <laughs> then you open the next one. I guess where you're going on the 20th of September. Really? Yeah. Are you joking? No, I got them today. You got them today? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm getting sick. And Regan's going. Does she know? Yeah. She knows? Yeah. Do you speak to her? Yeah. Um, that's, you said it wasn't big. No. That's big. <laughs> That's massive. <laughs> the 27th. The no, the 20th, the day I'm going. Oh, so with you? Yeah. How did you get them today? Um, I don't want to stop it. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, as you just seen on the last clip, um, Erin recorded me giving me a gift because it's the next day now. But I'm just, it's like, adding it on a bit longer because basically to edit and like put to put the video up for today. But the last clip of me explaining that result, that last clip got deleted off my camera. Don't know how, but it just did. But anyway, it's the next day. Um, I'm still going to talk about results. I just need to film that clip in a minute. While we were away on holiday, we were trying to get them and they all sold out instantly. I tried pre-ordering them and then when they went on sale with everyone else's. Friend's boyfriend Kira managed to get her and him the tickets for the 20th of September. Today, Erin was in work. She put on H's Instagram, is anyone selling tickets for the same date or any other available dates in Manchester because obviously it's closer to where we live. And she managed to get them. And I can't believe it because I really, really wanted to go. Because my friend found out today because I wanted my friend Regan to come with me because she's a fan of them as well. So Erin got two tickets for us. I'm actually over the moon. So yeah, it's all on the floor because I've been taking photos, but yeah. Basically, as you saw, she put it in the envelope and then it was like a open one and then open two. Yeah, it says, well done, passing you all your GCSEs. Just because you did so amazing, I have a little surprise. Guess what? And then it says guess. And I opened this one and it said, guess where you're going on Friday the 20th of September with Regan. You're going to see it. But yeah, that was just a little something to add to this video because... Why, why not obviously it's a, it's a well done present and yeah yesterday as well i'm just gonna this is just like a little gift haul <laughs> dad got me a card congratulations and well done card here also got me a tray of chocolates which i've already started eating my way through which are my absolute favorites and then they got me these flowers which is a combination of ones but they're so bright I just wanted to come on here and explain like more clearly what I ended up getting because obviously my live reaction like video wasn't very clear as we all over the place. So yeah, basically I passed both my normal maths and my numeracy maths with C's. I also got a C in my English language but from last year I have two B's and an A from all the English exams I've sat. I've got five B's one being in physical education so pa another in re another in drama i think i had two in travel and tourism i don't know what the other b is in i've got it on here actually so yeah so i got them b's and then i got one a which was in got an a start in travel and tourism and i got an, another a in travel and tourism two a's basically i have one a from english as well yeah i hope that makes sense basically i've got two c's five b's one a and one a star but yeah i'm personally like really really happy with that the people's c's will be other people's a stars or a's me to pass maths that was like the only thing i cared about before opening it then obviously once i opened everything else i was more bothered about my options and things like PA like I really did want to do well in that I personally I don't know if, like what subjects I would have want to do better in because like having a B is like really good to me I don't know like maybe I would would have wanted to got like an A drama if anything but I'm happy with the B 
The only reason I say it is because I got an A in my actual practical. Honestly, I'm like made up with all of that. And yeah, I hope everyone else was happy with their results with what they got. Obviously, everyone does differently everyone sits different kind of exams i've actually from my results i've able to get into the sixth form i kind of knew i could get into it anyway or i was in but i know for sure i am in there now and more importantly i will never have to do maths again in my life what i know of and obviously i've got my english and science i didn't re don't really need i didn't wouldn't have needed that if i went college or sixth form but i have my english, english and maths which obviously matter and i passed yeah i'm done with high school now completely I've applied for apprenticeships in private like travel agents kind of thing. That is something I'd like love to do because I obviously like to travel. I've got travel and tourism now as a backup if I was to go into that. Thanks for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed my reaction. I'll see you on my next one. Bye.